It's very difficult to talk about Ronaldo in the past tense. I've known him for many, many years, and you know whether we meet often or not, to just know that he's there, that uh, you know he's still sort of guiding us, still there to go and meet, meant a lot to me. And every trip that I made to Kolkata, I went and met him, him and Gita Di. I don't think there's been any trip that I've you know, been to the city and not met him, whether it was at home or in the later months in the hospital. And he was always so spirited, always so affectionate, loving, caring. So um, his going has, you know, sort of taken away something very, very personal, very, very important in my life. But, uh, but you know, he'll always be there and all those memories will be there. Um, every time I would go and meet him, you know, his, his personality was such that it was, he was very funny, he was very humorous, a lot of the humor was self-deprecating. He would make fun of how he looked, how he talked, how, what people said about him. And uh, there was a certain lightness of being. Despite being, you know, one of the greatest filmmakers India has ever produced, there was a sense of lightness about him, of not taking himself seriously. In fact, even during the shoot, uh, when I did Amar Bhuban, you know, half the time we would be talking about what is going to be cooked in the evening. Um, he would tell us stories about Gita Di, and you know, the minute we would come back from the shoot, he would he would call her. That loving relationship that's become more and more rare these days was such a delight to see. There was something so human. The village where we shot, he would just make friends with everybody in the village, right from a small child to an old person to the women in the village to everyone they all just loved him and you know he loved them all uh, that was so special but when he would work then his focus amidst all that humor and fun and games that seemed his his focus was so sharp and so deep and so instinctive um, he had a deep caring for people especially common people and you know those uh, whose stories are less and less told and that's why all his all his films reflect that concern, right from Bhuvan Shom to um, you know to Agdin Pratidin to Mrigaya to Padatek to um, I mean there are there are hundreds of films to um, Akale Shondhane to of course Amar Bhuvan which I had the good fortune of working with him on and many many others Khandahar uh, the list is really long but in each of the films you see complex human relationships, you see a socio-economic political context and, and they are rooted, you know, they are, the stories are really rooted to the world that he knew. Um, he also did an Odia film, Mati Ramoniso, and he would often tease me about my being in Odia and tell me stories from there. So, and you know, we had such a, such a deep bond that um, I never felt whether he was there, you know, physically or not, just the fact that he was there in this world made me feel uh, more hopeful, more more loved, uh, you know, more uh, inspired. So, uh, Rinalda, you are deeply, deeply being missed by all those whose lives you have touched and you have touched many lives. So, um, I hope you're smiling and uh, you're watching uh, us and the world is getting worse without your presence. So. Um, guide us through all of this and uh, continue to be our inspiration.